Hey everyone, the backyard guy here. This is Khaki, and she is a Khaki Campbell duck, and she is a one in 10,000 duck. And I'm going to uh, explain why, but first I want to tell you a little bit about the story of Khaki. She's going on her third fall here at the house, and she is the oldest bird in our poultry flock. And that's because she's an amazing survivor. She has survived a mink that was picking off ducks one at a time. She's also been the sole survivor of a fox attack. One time I was working up in my office and I heard her squawking and I looked out and she had a snapping turtle on her leg and I ran out into the pond um, and yanked that thing off of her. Khaki is an amazing survivor. She's uh, been a great provider of eggs over the year. She's had her own nest that she sat on. But, but this year, I noticed something extra special about Khaki that I've never seen before. And um, I would say earlier this summer, we, we had five ducks and a fox got the lone male. So this entire summer, we have been at just, you know, four female ducks. Well, I noticed an odd thing this morning, and when I went to make breakfast, I noticed that um, one of the eggs in the frying pan was fertilized. When I came out to the poultry um, later that day to let them out and run around, I noticed <laughs> Khaki was mating one of the other ducks. So one thing you might not know about ducks is they can actually change sex. And that's what Khaki did. It's a very, very rare thing. From what I understand, it's a one in 10,000 thing. So how does this happen? How does a female duck become a male duck? It's fascinating. The left ovary ceases to function. And this can happen for a couple of reasons. It can happen because there's some disease that affects the duck or it's damaged. It can also happen, like I think it happened in Khaki's case, where there's just an imbalance in the flock. So once that left ovary ceases to function, it stops producing estrogen. Now, instead of being represented as XY and you know, XX like a human, ducks are represented as ZZ or ZW. The ZW is the female. So when it stops producing estrogen, it defaults as if it's ZZ. The crazy thing that you might not know about male ducks is that they actually regrow their penis every year around mating season. So now that Khaki is producing testosterone, she's grown a penis. Crazy. What we can now expect from Khaki is that she's most likely gonna start molting her feathers and she's gonna actually become more male in appearance. So she's gonna have darker feathers around her head. But what's really special about this duck is not only has it taken on the characteristics of a male duck, she's also been able to fertilize eggs, which is extremely rare. So Khaki just keeps impressing me with uh, her crazy life that she has here and her ability to survive and adapt. So just to clarify, this isn't like some kind of sexual preference change. She biologically, naturally, is now able to fertilize eggs and will no longer lay eggs. She is a biological male. You guys are probably having flashbacks to the movie Jurassic Park right now. I'm the Backyard Guy, and I'll see you next time. Ah, ah.